In today's video, I'm going to give you my top traveling tips for traveling and eating raw on a high raw plant-based lifestyle. Definitely do some planning in advance when you know that you're traveling. There's a lot of websites online where you can look up to see local vegan or vegetarian restaurants. Uh, one of my favorites is happycow.net and I know there's a lot out there so definitely Google it and find what works for you. Um, when you're Googling, when you're searching for these types of establishments or <clears throat> when you're searching for raw food establishments or restaurants that can cater to your needs, definitely type in raw food or vegetarian and then the city that you're going to travel to and a lot of different things should come up in the list that will help you decide on where it is you want to eat and where you're going to have access to the most healthiest, nutritious food when you're traveling. Another tip I like to use is to prepare some foods in advance to take with you. If you're going on a road trip, definitely fill up a cooler full of fruits, veggies, or dried fruit and snacks that you make in advance so that you have them easily accessible. Or you can take them with you in your luggage, just be sure to pack foods that aren't going to leak all over your clothes and check the TSA guidelines for flying beforehand because they change often and then you'll know what you can take with you on your carry-on or in your luggage. When you're traveling and you arrive at your destination, plan on making the grocery store one of your very first stops. There you can stock up on everything you need to take back with you to your hotel, wherever it is that you're staying. If you know what hotel you're staying at and if you can make these travel arrangements, try and get a room with a kitchen, especially one that's stocked with a blender. This will help because you can store and prepare your foods while you're traveling. If you're meeting up with people in a restaurant that isn't vegetarian friendly, definitely eat before you go. This will help you curb cravings and or temptations and most restaurants almost always have a salad or some types of fruits or vegetables that you can eat while you're there and eating in advance will make it easier on yourself, especially if those are the only food items that you can order. A really important tip I like to talk about is to drink lots of water. When you're traveling, your body is adjusting to a new environment and it's really easily to get backed up or constipated. By drinking a lot of water, you're going to ease discomfort you may have that you might associate with your food, but really it's just because you're traveling. If you're having a hard time finding a restaurant online that says whether or not they serve vegetarian or vegan options, definitely call ahead and see what accommodations they can make. Most chefs are more than happy to accommodate someone's nutritional needs. Another great tip is to look at menus online. If you can access menus online and know what you're gonna choose ahead of time, this will help you a lot. It'll take a lot of stress out of it and when everyone's looking at the menu, you're not even gonna be stressed about what you're gonna pick. You're already gonna know what you want to order. And the last tip is if you're traveling internationally, make sure you check and see what foods are okay to take with you because some countries don't allow certain foods to cross borders for various reasons, whether it's transferring insects or types of bacteria or whatever it is. So definitely make sure you look up those guidelines before traveling across borders or internationally. Traveling is so much fun and it's amazing when you're able to maintain your lifestyle even when you're out and about and in new and uh, fun places. So I really hope these tips helped and I will see you in the next video.